Hello everyone, and welcome to my Bachelor Official YouTube channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribers button and give this video a thumbs up. Blake Moynes and Katie Thurston, the former Bachelorette, hadn't communicated with one another since their breakup. But when Katie appeared on this season of Bachelor in Paradise, that was all different. Fans are unsure of what will happen between Katie and Blake because they haven't yet seen why she is on the beach. They will undoubtedly speak at some point. Will their problems be resolved and why are they getting back together in November? In November, Katie Thurston and Blake Moynes will get back together. When former bachelorette Katie Thurston and Blake Moynes got together in paradise this summer, things must not have gone too wrong. She even resumed following him on social media after her stay there. Nobody knows for sure why Katie is heading to the beach as of yet. Considering that she is now on F-Boy Island, most people presume it's to send out a date card. To remind everyone, Blake and Katie weren't engaged for very long. Shortly after their breakup, she began dating someone else. Blake thought there had been emotional deception. It had been a full year and a half since their breakup, and they had never spoken until she showed up on the beach. Now that they are getting back together in November, Katie and Blake both posted on Instagram. What is happening? At the 8th Annual Gala of Global Conservation Force, Katie and Blake will be getting back together. Katie resides in San Diego, where the event will be held. Speaking of Blake, she posted the link to her Instagram story. The program is scheduled for Sunday, November 5 from 11.30 a.m. to 3.30 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. Blake also mentioned that Katie and he would be attending together. Why is there a gala? Blake Moynes and Katie Thurston are scheduled to attend a distinguished banquet at the gorgeous Bali High in San Diego, according to the event page. For everyone who attends, it promises to be an enchanting atmosphere. It will encourage discussion about wildlife. Enjoy breathtaking views of San Diego Bay and the downtown cityscape as you immerse yourself in the rich cultural legacy of the Polynesian islands and savor a delicious assortment of Polynesian cuisine, according to the event page. An auction will also take place. Bid on exclusive and one-of-a-kind items, like as artwork, trips, and things from around the globe, with all earnings going directly towards supporting the vital work of Global Conservation Force, according to the website. As of right now, tickets can be purchased. They will go on sale on November 1. What are your thoughts on Katie and Blake's apparent reconciliation for the sake of protecting wildlife? Observe this space for updates. Katie Thurston, a former bachelorette, appears on a new dating program. Why did she accept F. Doy Island right away? See what she has to say by continuing to read. Producers of Baccalaureate Parties Manipulate Drama, says Katie Thurston. Katie Thurston has now participated in numerous reality series. She first came to light as a participant on The Bachelor's 25th season, when she gave Matt James an offensive toy during their first encounter. Thurston ended up as The Bachelorette's lead for season 17, even though she didn't finish up with James. Following a season replete with drama that saw her frontrunner, Greg Grippo, abruptly leave the show, Katie Thurston discovered love and became engaged to Blake Moynes. But the turmoil seemed to follow them off screen, as the pair called it quits on their engagement a few months later. Katie Thurston has been transparent about the negative aspects of her Bachelor show experience. She agreed to participate in another reality show in part because of this. Thurston appears in several episodes of CW's F-Boy Island in Season 3. Speaking with E! News, Thurston hinted that one distinction between the two series is that The Bachelorette's turmoil was manufactured, while the CW show's conflict is organic. Did she just accuse the creators of Bachelor Nation of fabricating drama? 
There wasn't a lot of manipulation, strife for disturbances occurring behind the scenes. You recognize that everything that occurred that was dramatic was genuine drama. Because time is of the essence, one becomes irritated when they begin to see something as being manufactured, as stated by Katie Thurston of E! News. Fans won't see her return to the franchise, based on her remarks regarding her experience on The Bachelorette. Right. Not so quickly. Not quite over with Bachelor Country. Katie Thurston will be on a future episode of Bachelor in Paradise, in addition to FBOA Island. Blake Moynes, her former fiancé, is a competitor in Season 9 of the ABC series. Although Katie Thurston's actual function on BIP is unknown, it's likely that she is merely there to send out date invitations, rather than seek romantic partners. Thurston recently told us weekly 25 things about herself that her admirers are unaware of. She lied to get on the program, which is one thing that might surprise Bachelor Nation. Katie Thurston disclosed in a less dramatic way that she received invites to appear on FBOY Island and BIP two weeks apart. What inspired Katie Thurston to accept FBOY Island? Why would Katie Thurston consent to participate in yet another dating reality program following her traumatic experience on The Bachelorette? She said to E. News that the shows that convinced her to accept Half-Boy Island differ significantly from one another. Katie Thurston had never seen Half-Boy Island in her two previous seasons, but then they called. HBO Max aired the reality show's first two seasons. After being canceled in late 2022, it returned for season three on The Sea Guy. There are other leads on the show besides Katie Thurston, unlike The Bachelorette. Influencer Daniela Grace and model Holly Okioo accompany her on their own adventures. An engagement ring is not a Foy Island's ultimate desire. For those unfamiliar with the show, E! News offers a synopsis. Three leading ladies relocate to a tropical island home to 24 unmarried guys. Twelve of those men identify as nice guys and the remaining twelve as F boys. While the F-boys are vying for money, the good guys are searching for love. The women must first make an effort to fall in love before figuring out which guys are which. The chance to win both love and money at the same time attracted Katie Thurston. She also appreciated having two women by her side. Being the star on a reality TV show can be really isolating, so Thurston added, it was just so much fun every night to do it, with two other women who are in the exact same role as you. Was Katie Thurston's motivation for joining F. Boy Island Sound? Post your ideas in the comments section. F. Boy Island's third season premiered on Mondays. But starting on November 3, the show will now air on Fridays, according to TV Line. However, on October 30, a fresh episode will still air in the customary Monday time slot before being permanently moved to Fridays. Fans of FBOY Island will thus be treated to two brand new episodes starting next week. Thanks for watching if you like this video, so please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and don't miss any updates.